Good morning everybody! It's me again, Crazy Bag Lady! It's Thursday morning! I hope you're all okay, my dears. It's pouring with rain. It's a bit gloomy this morning. Miss Winifred's on a mission to be a bit naughty this morning. I don't know why she keeps barking, but she just keeps barking. Can you hear her? <laughs> I don't know what she's trying to tell me, but she's annoying me this morning. I think she likes the sound of her own voice. <laughs> so I hope you're all okay with this. So it is this morning. Um, at midnight tonight, we go into full lockdown. So after midnight tonight, everything's going to change. So we can't meet up with anybody. We can't see anybody. It's just an absolute nightmare. So today, me and Ruby are hoping to gonna go, we're going to go around some charity shops before things change. Although I think... From what I can weigh up on the guidelines and stuff, I think a lot of the shops are staying open. Um, so we might still be able to go shopping next week and stuff, but obviously we have to be super, super careful because the, the cases are very high around around us. So I don't I mean, know. I just don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, today me and Ruby, when she gets dressed, we're going to go around some charity shops. So happy morning. Right. I really need to make my mind up about my tracksuits. <clears throat> so obviously I bought all these tracksuits yesterday. I did like a video where I tried them all on. And now I need to decide what to send back and I can't make my mind up. I hate making decisions, but I've got to be sensible. I really don't need three tracksuits. Lipstick of the day, Amy. Now my washing machine's decided to go into overdrive. <laughs> so we've had our breakfast, we're getting ready to go out. So I thought just grab the first lipstick that you put you. I put my hand in the bag, I thought just grab the first one. So the first one I picked out was this one. So it's a prism lipstick by Avon and the colour is Energy Flash. Let's hope it gives us some energy today. So it's like a very orangey colour. It looks really bright in the tube. I don't think it's quite as bright when it's on your lips. And it's actually quite a nice colour. I looked at it and thought, mm, I don't really want to put that on. But now I've put it on, it's actually really nice. So we've got some energy flash. So these are the prism lipsticks. They smell of palmer violets, um, those little purpley sweets. It's really nice and they have a lovely sheen to them. They're just really, really lovely, really lovely lipstick. And this colour is just it's amazing it's so different it's like orange and red and it's just i really like it right i think we're finally ready to go i just need to get my coat on i want to show you my guardian oh it's so adorable so it's got these beautiful sparkly buttons it's just so cute and then i've got my parcel to return to zara and my money to pay in for breast cancer so i can donate to my breast cancer care charity thing that i did so i raised just under 50 so i'm going to round it up to 50 so we've made 50 pound for them so i shall pay it in later and then get a receipt and show you all Yay. in the car so first job this morning i've got to go and take the zara thing are you wait here i'll go take it Oh, right, first job done. So I paid the money in for breast cancer and then I need to work out how I get the money to them. I need to read the instructions that when I get home. Uh, post and return to Sara. I've returned the brown tracksuit and the grey one and I've kept the black one. Um, I liked all of them. They were all alright, weren't they? But I just thought, I'm not really a tracksuit person. And or even if I'd have kept them, I probably wouldn't have worn them or not worn them enough. So they've gone back to Zara. What a day. We must be crazy to be coming out today. We're out today. It's horrible. <laughs> They're real. One's inside the baby. Good, aren't they? Oh yeah, I've got that in my mask. Mm, let's quick get my mask out. Yeah. <laughs> That's good, doesn't it? We should do that. Instead of carving one of them, we'll put eyelashes on it and make, we can put some lipstick on it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're on the hunt for Jacqueline Wilson books, so we're going to go in the bookshop and have a look, aren't we? Yeah. I don't think there is any. Do you? Mm -hmm. Yeah.
No, I don't I know, the joys of shopping in masks, it does make you out brown. Jane, step away from the coats. <laughs> I can't help it, I'm drawn to them. Coats and jumpers, I like coats and jumpers. That's quite cool, isn't it? It's like a cape. Step away from the cape, Jane. Stay away. <laughs> so funny. Oh, well, this and Gromit costume. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> It's dinner time though, isn't it? Look, they've sold everything. Oh, oh wow. Is it what's left, Ruby? Do you like that, Ruby? Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Very fancy, very fancy lady. And we made it back to the car. Shopping is so not glamorous anymore at all. So, my mask, well, I've just constantly steamed up the whole time. So, I've been constantly smogged. Um, then your mask gets all a bit like damp and moisturised and sort of sweaty and uh, it's horrible isn't it? <laughs> right anyway we're going to one more on the way home let's go! It smells like toast. Yeah it does smell like toast I don't know why. <laughs> right let's go and look in the last one. We're a bit late it's already one o'clock I'm ready for my dinner. Oh, a good old post box. I think that's been repainted it's yeah, very red. Yeah, it's very bright. Yeah. Horrid Henry, do you think there's going to be Jacqueline Wilson's? Oh, look at them little coaster things. <laughs> They're so oh. funny.
So you're not, you're not doing that for anyone, and no voucher or anything. So if it doesn't fit me, I'm not sure that it will fit me though. So. Um, Wicked and wonderful words by women. Mm. I've been rich and I've been poor. Rich is better. <laughs> Never eat more than you can lift by Miss Piggy. in the car it's now half past one we desperately need to go home my little tummy's all empty <laughs> all right we finally made it home it's five to two i cannot believe how late it is so there's my little dinner i've got seafood steaks little tomatoes mackerel in tomato sauce and a cup of coffee in my i love shopping mug everywhere needs tidying up i need to wash up and to dishwasher put stuff away i've got my bed to make oh I shouldn't have gone anywhere today, but sometimes you just need to get out for a bit. So there's my little dinner. <laughs> Not sure what's going off in this little corner. I think somebody's trying to make themselves very comfy. I've just done a separate little unboxing from my Topshop order. Mm, I'm now stressing, thinking, do I need to keep the coat or not? <laughs> coat dilemmas. Yesterday it was tracksuit dilemmas, today is coat dilemmas. So it's nearly three o'clock, my hubby's on his way back, my food shopping's coming between four and five, so it's coming a bit later today. Um, and then I've got to cook tea, so another day has nearly gone by. The days just go so fast, don't they? So, right, let's get the kettle on again. Ooh, right, I'm just about to make a coffee. Mr. Tesco man has arrived half an hour early. Uh, at least it gets it over and done with anyway. So we'll do the Tesco food, then we'll have a coffee. Mm -hmm. You know what happened next day after that removal, but then we will be <laughs> Ooh, Right, we need to get it all put away now. So it's all come. Let's get the shopping put away. Oh, sometimes I really hate shopping online. So my yogurts have arrived and look at the date. They run out of date today. How is that acceptable? How has that even got through some sort of quality control? That is just absolute crap. So I've now got to waste my time, ring up, complain about my yogurts. I don't know what else has got short dates, but that is absolute rubbish. Ooh, right, that's Tesco rung up. So they're going to refund me for my yogurts. So now I need to make my bed. Ooh, it's never ending. And then we need to make tea. Ooh, it's a bit hot and steamy in my kitchen, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Right, so for tea tonight, we've got some beautiful salmon that I've got to cook um, and some little new potatoes and then some salad with it. So what I do, I've boiled them so they're soft, then I've squashed them, as you can see. Then I've put some so like thick rock salt over the top of them, pop them in the oven for about half an hour and they go all golden and crispy. They've got olive oil on them. They are beautiful. So let's get them in the oven. Right, back to finishing off my bed while my potatoes are in the oven. Ooh, back to the cooking. So tonight I'm very busy with my salmon. So I've got some Mary Berry uh, dressing that I put over the top of it. It makes the salmon taste absolutely amazing. It's definitely been one of those days. So I went to my oven thinking that my potatoes would be half done so I can put my salmon in and I hadn't put the temperature on. I'd put the oven on, but I'd not put the temperature on so they were just sat there with the light on and no heat. So my dinner's now running 20 minutes behind. Ooh, right, my little potatoes are done. So I'm just waiting for my nice bit of salmon now. Don't they look absolutely beautiful? So simple and so nice. Just remember to turn your oven on. <laughs> and I've made my donation to the breast cancer charity. So I've just donated 50 pound and then apparently they send you a pink certificate with the 
you name on to show that you raised the money so i can't wait for that so when my certificate arrives i'll be able to show you all but we donated 50 pound today oh right finally i've got my tea you have to forget to put my oven on so there's my teas my little potatoes my salmon and my salad so off to enjoy it oh right we've just made a really funny discovery um i don't know if anybody else has heard it but there's a song called the baked potato song um and it's sue and matt lucas and i heard it on the radio this morning it's really funny so i've just showed it ruby on youtube and we can't stop laughing so if i remember i'll try and put the link down below to the baked potato song thank you baked potato <laughs> can you turn up you're gonna love the baked potatoes aren't you ever get the feeling you're being watched look at a little beady eyes look she looks at you when you think when she thinks you're not looking. <laughs> Are you watching us with your little beady eyes? I can see you. Oh, I love you so much. Look at that cute little face. Look at that little nose. Oh, you're so cute. Are we annoying you? <laughs> you're so adorable. Now, of all the places to sit, you have to sit on my foot in the whole house. <laughs> nice to know you loved. Right, I need to empty the bin now. Ooh, ladies and gentlemen, we're going out. Don't get too excited. We're going out to the bin. <laughs> now, new night's entertainment is bin. Going out to the bin. Right, what did we buy today? So today we bought, well, Ruby got this gorgeous to bake a little um, like canvas bag. Look how amazing this is. I love it so much. And it's like new. It's absolutely beautiful. So that was what Ruby got. Uh, Ruby also got this cute little thing. <laughs> and also this very strange thing. It's like a squidgy banana. Why she wanted this, I have no idea, but she really did. Um, I got this cool hair clip that I thought I can put at the back of my hair. When I wear my hair up in a bun, um, you can kind of put that at the back and it holds up the shorter hairs and pushes your bun forward a bit. I got this book because it was only 30p and some of the stuff in it, what it said was just absolutely brilliant and I loved it so much. And I thought for 30p, that's coming home with me. I got this cute little top. It is one from Next, but it's short sleeved. But I thought it still might work under some of my cardigans and stuff. So that was really cool. I got this vintage, um, it's not real fur, it's like fake fur, um, like little cape thing, but it has got arms, so it's like a little shrug thing. I'll try and show it on in a minute, it's really cool. And then we've got this cute little penguin, which we couldn't resist, even though he drops a bit of fake snow everywhere, but we loved him so much. So there's our little purse penguin, he's so cute. So we're going to sit him near the door, bless him. What do you think to him, Winnie Fred? Do you like him? Little Percy Penguin, <laughs> so cute, cute little shrug, Ta -da! so it has got armholes so it does lift up, Um, so it's not just like a shrug that can fall off as such because it's got armholes, it's very cute, it's lovely, it's all vintagey and nice and I thought you could probably put like a big sparkly like brooch or something on it would be really cool Um, and I bet you could even wear it with like chunky jumpers and stuff so I really like that, it's really different. Oh, here's the little top. How cute is this? I think you probably could get away with wearing it over a shirt. It's adorable. It's so cute. I love it. I really do feel that we need to go live again very soon, don't we? Because I've had so many messages, people are upset and fed up and oh, and we're all in this together and it's just absolutely crap. I don't swear on this channel, but it does make you feel like swearing and it's just, it's just rotten, isn't it? We can't see our loved ones and now everybody's starting to worry about Christmas and, and uh, the ones that are in like real lockdown, like obviously we're going into tier three at midnight so James can't see his friends, you can't see his friends, I can't see my mum. It's just, it's awful. So please just stay safe wherever you are. We're all in it together. So just keep hanging on together. Do what you can at home. Do some decorating, wallpapering, even jigsaws, anything just to keep you busy. Don't think too much about the future. That like my mum always says, just take each day as it comes. So just enjoy the little things. So if you've got a pet and you manage to take them for a walk or... 
you know, even if you go and just walk through the leaves and let the leaves sort of rustle under your feet and just anything you can do to keep you safe and sane. And phew, it's very hard, but I know exercise does help. So if you can get out for a walk or whatever and just don't worry about it too much. Just concentrate on today. That's what my mum always says, concentrate on today and tomorrow. So if the sun comes out, it's a, a nice or we're all here together anyway. So huge hugs, let's have virtual hugs, my darling. So please take care. Huge shout out to my queen ears. I hope you're all okay, my darling. So please, please just stay safe. So if you do enjoy just a bit of real life and just sticking together, then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. So I love you and leave you and I'll speak to you tomorrow, my darlings. Bye.